welcome to DocuTrack. DocuTrack is a DAP for sharing and managing documents. All documents are stored only in encrypted form. In this video, I'll show you how you can request a file from a friend who doesn't have a DocuTrack account and also how to share with friends who do have an account. When logging in for the very first time, I need to create an internet identity. Internet identity is my key to the internet computer. And actually, I don't need to remember any password. I can rely on the fingerprint sensor or on the face ID from my phone. I can actually rely on hardware security that is much safer than my brain. When logging in for the first time, I need to pick a username. When I do that, the app will generate a public and a private key in the browser and store the public key in the backend canister hosted on the internet computer. Now I see an empty list of files, but this will change during this demonstration. Okay, as a first step, I will ask my good friend, friend Tony, to send me a picture. And I would like to have a picture of a sleeping cat. A link is being generated and I can share this link by any communication channel with Tony. I can use email, I can use a chat app, but in this presentation, I'm simply gonna pretend to be Tony in another browser window. You can see here, I'm using an incognito browser window. I paste this link and I'm not logged in. Um, so Tony has never registered, Tony doesn't have an internet identity or anything, but now um, we will upload a picture of a cat. I hope you like it. And when clicking on upload file, what happens is that the DAP makes um, the browser create a secret key and um, the file is then being encrypted with this secret key. And next, the secret key itself is encrypted with my public key which um, was transported to Pony with um, um, this link. And um, both the encrypted secret key and the encrypted file are uploaded to the internet computer. Now I go back to my browser. So you see, we're back to Minimouse. And um, if I refresh and go to files, I see that a sleeping cat picture has been uploaded and only I have access to it. We can have a look at it. It's really the picture that um, Tony uploaded before. And of course, I would like to share this with my good friend, Alice in Wonderland. By saving this, um, what takes place in the background is that Alice public key is requested um, from the browser and the secret key, which I have in unencrypted form for this picture is being encrypted with her public key. And um, that is then stored on the internet computer. And if I now pretend to be Alice, and let's uh, log in as Alice. Alice has um, registered before then um, Alice will see that a sleeping cat picture has been shared with her and she can also have a look at it. Now, um, instead of just requesting someone to from someone uh, a file, um, I can also upload um, files directly. Um, in order to do that, let me go back to my Minnie Mouse browser if I want to upload a file cat picture yes I am into cats and I upload this file um, it's only being encrypted for myself and when I um, look at it here I can share it uh, with other people I think our coach will like um, this picture as well and Alice so yeah let's share it with these two and this concludes my presentation. I hope you enjoyed it and have a lot of fun with DocuTrack. Thanks.